they will be harvesting it around the 1.2, 1.5 tons of paddy of rice. Okay, just a paddy. So one ton of paddy, if it is dried, the paddy rice printed in Chairman is here, Mr. Raj Sharma. They will buy from your farm at $800 per ton. Yes. So if you multiply, you will harvest 1.5 tons. We have advertised now for cane cutters, uh, echoing what Pia Sugar had to say, you know, we've got an opportunity now for people who, who need money, who need livelihood, to come and join hands with us, help run the industry and earn some hard-earned money for themselves and their families. So that advertising will continue. Uh, we are launching now the training program for our harvester operators, again mentioned by Pia Sugar, so together with the Cane Growers Council, uh, some of the more prominent harvester owners and support from uh, the manufacturers of both Case and Shaktiman in India who will support us electronically with our training. We, we will launch a, a program in the next week or so to get more and more local operators trained on how to uh, operate our mechanical harvesters so that we're not impacted at the start of the season. As far as our factories are concerned, uh, we have managed to get over the challenges thrown at us with the, the COVID-19 lockdown and TC Herald as well. Um, and we're probably about two weeks uh, behind schedule, uh, but we're catching up fast. I'm pleased to say that our logistics challenges have been solved, the ports are open, equipment is arriving. We pay a special thanks to Fiji Airways who are helping us with air freighting things around from around the world to get our factories ready. So we, we have announced with the tribunal the start dates for the factories for this year, where we'll start once more with Lambasa first. Now food security in terms of rice needs for the household. Ladies and gentlemen, uh, we will also be launching uh, another program uh, with respect to providing villages with the rice seeds, those who sign up the Tony Kuru, that they are willing to plant this particular, uh, this, put aside this amount of land for rice production. We'll be launching that program soon. We've got a dedicated officer who's going around getting the villagers to sign up who are, who are interested in getting to rice farming and we will be providing them, we will be supervising them. I know there have been requests from uh, rice farmers in Central Division and the Western Division to provide to them a drive. In August, we'll be establishing a drive in Bar and Nelanga Bar. We're expecting two drives to come. We'll be establishing a drive in Nelanga Bar at our agriculture waterway uh, depot there. And we will be also establishing a drive in Central Division. We will also be providing portable meals at different spots where farmers can get together and mill their rice for their own consumption. Ladies and gentlemen, there are several other programs that will be working very closely.